this so much better. Excuse me, I'd love to ask you a few questions about your work. Sorry, but... Oh, you're Max Caulfield, right? Tell me what kind of instant camera you um, use. Can we talk later? Thanks. I literally do not have the time to deal with everybody. doing the time. My previous timeline was so perfect. I'll accept that I need to be in Arcadia Bay, not San Francisco. I just have to make one simple change so I won't end up in San Francisco. Simple. Sorry, San Francisco. Chloe comes first. Everything. What did you say, Max? What? Jefferson should be in jail, not here. Jesus. It's like you're back in my class. You're still spacing out. It might be cool if you took one of your patented selfies now. The transformation between the old Max and the new Max. Anyway, answer my question, please. Fuck you. Good answer. Good answer. Hey, your nose is bleeding. Probably gave you too big a dose. Sorry about that, Max. But considering you're about to die, a nosebleed is a first world problem. Your iris, that dilation like a shudder. The pictures you're taking of me now. Too bad you pissed away your gift. You could have won the contest. But you destroyed your own beautiful photograph. What a waste. Sorry, I burned all your stuff. I got a little carried away. Fuck. He no, burned my diary. I always. That's why I'm still here. Especially since you've developed from nerd to hero within a week. There's something weird going on with you. Whoa, did you see how crazy it is outside? Like I said, something weird. There's that fear. Oh, Max, it's an honor working with you on these final sessions. I hope these images will be appreciated for what they truly capture. The loss of youth. <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. And I promise you, 
No more nosebleeds. Mr. Jefferson, please, don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. Please, don't do this. This final dose won't hurt. What? David. <coughs> no, David, no! Jesus! David Madsen! He's out cold. Good. I always hated that fascist fuck. Everybody at Blackwell did, right, Max? Okay, let's try this one last time. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Wait, hold on. Can I... Can I please ask you for one last... request? Oh, you got me, Max. How can I deny that face? Would you uh, take one last picture of me? I, I want to be your best subject. I almost don't believe that, but I think you finally learned from me. This final dose won't hurt. What? And I promise you. Could he please at least play some music so I can drift away? Even at the end, you're still a dreamer, Max. It's a nice trait. No way, Jefferson. And I promise you. Uh, excuse me, but my, my throat is scratchy. Can I please have some water? Of course. I don't want you to be uncomfortable. I promise. This final dose won't hurt. What? David, watch out! How? How did you know that? <laughs> 
No gun. No balls. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. <laughs> David Madsen. Of course. Well, this is what you get for playing cop. A real bullet. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to Grab stop. Grab your gun me. now. Got it. <laughs> oh Christ, David Madsen, you are one stupid son of a bitch. It's over. You are not going to stop me. <laughs> You are not going to stop me. Oh, Lord, Max. Are you okay? Are you all right? Can you move? Yes. Thank you, David. Thank you. No, thank me. You brought me here. Let's wrap up this son of a bitch first. He won't be going anywhere when he wakes up. Except you are going to prison forever. Or worse. Mr. Jefferson, now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. Save Chloe. He burned everything, including all of my photos. Warren, yes, I, I can use that picture he took of us. Shit, no signal. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson, but you won't need this anymore. Max. I'm sorry you had to be here. Jefferson looks so pathetic now. David? Are you okay? Look at this place. It feels like hell. Jefferson was going to kill me. You got here just in time. I'm glad. I always suspected that son of a bitch. I never did. Until too late. You shouldn't have to suspect your teacher. He wasn't a real teacher. He just wanted to lecture. It was part of his sick plans. I wasn't surprised when you accused Nathan of drugging Kate Marsh. I thought so too. And Max, I'll never forgive myself for what happened to Kate. I feel like I helped push her off that roof. Kate was bullied up to that roof, but it was still Nathan and Jefferson who put her there. I knew Nathan Prescott was a threat. I just waited too long to neutralize him. Jefferson already did. They had some weird father-son thing going on. But Nathan killed Rachel, and Jefferson had to use him as a scapegoat. That pervert was pulling all this shit right under my nose, too. I could have stopped him and Nathan if only... I wasn't so stupid. No, I, I should have told Principal Wells Nathan had a gun and, and almost used it. I put the school in danger. We all make decisions we regret. But I have to admit, I'm impressed by you. And Chloe, and your investigation. I had all the high-tech toys while you had each other. Maybe she learned from you. I think she only learned how to hate my guts. I'm sure you know I, uh, I hit her the other day. I know you're sorry. I'm not gonna make any excuses for my behavior. I tried to be a good soldier, but I wasn't so great. I tried to be a good father too, but 